All right, so you want to mine Miami coin. Uh, in the next few minutes, I'm going to show you the super basics of how the process works, what to expect, and what not to expect. So the first thing you're going to do is go to minemiamicoin.com. You're going to be greeted with this page. And I'm just going to assume that you already have a hero wallet and stacks in your wallet. If you don't, maybe don't mind, but also give you some links in the description below on how to get those basics. But once you're here, you're going to hit connect wallet and choose the account that has stacks you want to mine with. And then you're going to click dashboard. And this is basically the UI. Uh, you have a mine button up here, a stack button and a redeem button. And there's two buttons here you can click and it gives you some uh, details. It says mining Miami coin happens by spending stacks in a given stacks block and the thing to realize about mining is, is there's always a cost involved and there's always uncertainty. So if you're mining in real life, you're mining for gold, uh, you have to go find a geographical location that might have gold. And you have to spend a bunch of resources in tools and man hours trying to hopefully mine gold. And there's, you don't know if you're going to get hit the jackpot or get nothing. This is the same way. So when you spend stacks to the block, you're hoping to win. But there's no guarantee. When that's, those stacks are sent, they're just sent. And this next point, you can see it here. A winner is selected randomly, weighted by the miner's proportion of con contributions of that block. So what that means is if there's a thousand stacks set in the block that you're about to mine in, and you put a thousand of your own stacks in there, you have a 50% chance of winning that block. Uh, if the number is 100 stacks and you put in 10, you have a 9% chance or whatever it is. I'm bad at math, but you get the point. So you're always weighted against everyone else in that pool for that block. So there's different techniques. You can, you can choose these options down below. You can mine for a single block or you can mine for many. How you want to do the distribute your mining over time, that's your decision, that's your strategy. But know that it's it's a uh, it's random and it's weighted by the other people in the block you're competing with them and only one person c can win that block and win the Miami coin for that block now that you know that once you're ready to send some stacks to the contract and try your hand at mining uh you'll come down here it says you'll click this box i confirm that by, by participating in mining i understand the city of miami has not yet officially claimed the uh contribution Participation does not guarantee winning the rights to claim newly minted MIA, like we just described. And once stacks are sent to the contract, they are not returned. So there's no, uh, no lost lottery here. What you'll do is you'll choose your strategy, mine one block, mine from multiple blocks. And in this example, let's say I'm going to send 10 stacks for one block, the next block. I will click send transaction. You'll get this dialog box. It'll confirm how many stacks you're going to send and mine tokens, which means for one block, or it'll say mine many if you want to choose how many blocks. And if you were going to do that, you would go here, mine many blocks, and it's going to say how many blocks do you want to mine? Let's say 10. You're going to choose the amount you want to put per block, and this could be variable. You can choose it 10, 10, 5, 5, however. Same thing. Once you get all your boxes filled, it will click send transaction. That same dialog box will, will uh, pop up and you will mine for that many blocks. Once you've submitted your, uh, your stacks to mining, you will go to redeem. And after 100 blocks have passed from when you mined, you can see if you want. Uh, a, a block happens every 10 minutes, roughly. So 100 blocks is about 16 hours. So whenever you're done, come back here to this page, you click check blocks, and if you won, you'll see a new dialog box pop up here that uh, has a transaction ID, and you can redeem your freshly minted Miami coin. That's it. That is, uh, that's the process. When you send money to the contract, 30% goes to the city of Miami treasury, and 70% goes back to stackers who already hold Miami coin from pre previous mining. And uh, 
they get paid back in stacks. That is the basic process. Um, proceed with caution, but also get the bag, whatever you want to do. Uh, but yeah, I've had, seen some questions. Hopefully this helps a little bit. That's it, though. See y'all later.